The city of El Centro held their formal reorganization of the city council on Wednesday evening. The formalities included saying goodbye to former council member John Edney and welcoming a new face and a new councilman, Jason Jackson. We are ready for a nomination for mayor. I nominate today is Sanders. Second. Okay. Please bow. Motion carry five Mrs. Sanders. Thank you. I get, I get the gavel and the name plaque, the gavel and the name plaque. That I take this obligation freely, yes. without any mental reservation, without any mental reservation. Or, purpose of evasion. or purpose of evasion, and that I will well and faithfully discharge the duties upon which I, I am about to enter. I'm very excited. You know, it's uh, you're right. It has been a long time coming. Um, you know, persistence pays off sometimes, and uh, you know, it's something I believed in, something I felt that I could do, and and um, you know, contribute to the city and try to make things better for the the uh, residents of El Centro. And so I, you know, kept running and persevered, and finally I'm here. So I'm certainly looking forward to tonight and the swearing-in ceremony, and um, you know, and then getting to work and, and actually working with the other council members and the department heads and the city manager and and uh, trying to make some improvements. And and, and move this city forward. And I'm here today for the swearing of the three new council members. They're not new, two of them, the incumbents one, and Jason Jackson's coming in. I think it's a very good turnout, and I'm interested in seeing how things go for the city of El Centro. I think it's going to be a great event. I'm very supportive of Sedalia as the mayor, and then the council here in El Centro. We're sister, you know, sister neighboring cities. It's always a great thing. We're here supporting the, the change of mayors and the reorganization. Uh, we're sorry to see John Edney go, and we welcome Jason Jackson to the council, and we're going to work together with the city of El Centro. Uh, it's good for the whole valley. If we all work together, we have to be one team uh, working together, and so we're here in support of that, and we think it's a great, uh, great to have a party and celebrate the new beginnings and, and the new year coming up, and so it's a wonderful event. Tonight I was selected to be the mayor for the city the fifth time. And the first time I was mayor, it was I was younger, and I was a little bit more naive, but the city was also smaller, about 20,000 people only. And so now we've seen the city has doubled. And with that doubling has also come some new challenges. One of the biggest challenges is the money and the state budget and the effects it's going to have on our community. But I feel encouraged by that because I think this council is prepared for that. And with our city staff and with this council's determination, we're going to make sure that we continue to provide a quality of life services for this community. Uh, this last year has been a tremendous experience. It's an honor that I will cherish forever. And, and getting out to the community, listening to the community, speaking on behalf of the city is something that is it's just a tremendous honor and uh, I couldn't be happier.